Mali's neighbours are playing hardball. West Africa's main regional bloc will impose sweeping economic sanctions after the Economic Community of West African States met to decide whether to accept the junta's offer to hold elections in December 2025 and remain in power as a transitional military government in the meantime. Mali had originally agreed to hold elections next month. La prorogation de la durée de la transition à cinq ans préoccupe l'ensemble de la région ouest africaine. Autant nous sommes conscients de la complexité de la situation de ce pays, autant nous pensons que toutes les réformes politiques, économiques et sociales visant la refondation du Mali ne pourraient être conduites que par des autorités démocratiquement élues. ECOWAS has decided to close borders with Mali, suspend all trade with the exception of basic necessities, stop all financial aid and freeze the country's assets held in the Central Bank of West African states. A travel ban on all members of the junta and their families will remain and their assets frozen. Mali has been ruled by military junta since August 2020, when the democratically elected president Ibrahim Boubacar Keita was ousted from power by the army. Colonel Simi Goita then took the reins, but in response to the threat of ECOWAS sanctions, he installed a transitional civilian government and promised elections in February 2022. However, the tables turned when Goita forced out the interim civilian government, consolidating his own power in a de facto second coup.